One of the greatest things to build in Minecraft is a secret base, but if you don't have a good way to hide your base, it's uh, not very secret, is it? This one your head. is so with a bed. Is a Looks bed. very interesting. And of course, you need it to be nighttime, which is kind of the only downside to this hidden house. So you, to get into your base, you need to be nighttime, all right. You get into the bed, oh, and, and you, when you leave the bed, you end up in your oh, hidden base. Oh, that looks so good. Isn't that That awesome? is so cool. Now the because it just, one second he's in, and, it's, and it takes you out of the bed on the other side of the wall. It, it feels really cool because it feels like you're, you're waking up in a different place. The chances of someone sleeping in your bed in Minecraft, well, it's not out of this world unreasonable. How would you get out? That's what but I want to know. It's Do you press a button or something? Happen, especially if you hide your Minecraft bed it, somewhere like this in a dummy base, which is Ooh. just meant to distract. So ah, that's got clever. exactly the same thing here, a bed. And this one doesn't actually have a base behind it. This one <laughs> has an infinity room. That's interesting. So like they made, it, it's like a decoy bed, but the infinity room. I've never actually built an infinity room. I think it's just using like white paintings, isn't it? Or something. I, I, they're kind of cool, but. Kind of weird for that. That's evil, Green. I didn't know you had this in you. I really didn't. Major floor. But when you have a bed and you sleep in it in Minecraft, when you leave the bed, you always end up at this block here. Now ah, that is always west. So that's what it is. So that's how you decide. That's how you do it. You always need to be west of where you put the bed. I might make one of these. I really, yeah, I think that's really cool. You know what? I'm getting ideas here. I'm liking it. This is good, Green. But this hidden house and yeah, you can't see it. It's actually here. It's right in front of you, but you can't see it. You can enter this it's at snowed any time. in. You just okay. have to remember where you put it. Oh, I wonder if this... So well, how does it get in, actually? I put it just about here. Nope, I didn't put it there. I must have put it here. Okay. I've lost my I've lost my hidden base. <laughs> He's lost I've his hidden, hidden base. I've hidden my base from my... There we oh, go, there we I go. found oh, it. Oh, okay, scaffolding. Right. So, as you can see, there is Ooh, some scaffolding. Oh, I like that. Basically, you can crouch straight through snow blocks if there is a scaffolding. Under. That's clever. Meaning, That's really clever. Where it is, oh, I'm getting so many added. You, you know what, Green? You're a genius. I'll give you, give you that right now. Grass. So, I know. Grass here. Straight down. That's a good idea as well. A bit of grass. You know, if you didn't know about that, there's no way you find that one. You are. That's even better it's than the bed the one. Fun. These are so simple. Like, like, you know, it's not a complicated one where you press a button and, I don't know, a massive house comes out of the floor or, you know, anything like that. This is a super simple place a scaffold in, place snow on top, crouch down below. And it's just, it's so cool. It's really, really cool. Now, this next hidden house is very interesting. Again... You can't see it. I'm still in the same biome, and it yeah. really doesn't matter what biome No it idea is. where it is. All you need is one of those. A small Ooh. letterbox. And the key to this hidden base is a boat. Oh, can now, you boat through? Now, what you do is you get in your boat. Ooh, now, you will cool. take a small amount of suffocation damage, but that's okay. You know, hidden houses, you have to have sacrifices. And then you it crouches ship, out and he's through. And you fall oh, he's underneath. Into your base. Oh, wow. Which is so cool now That's, the big issue here i want to see it again the boat is still ah, okay here. yeah it just now, looks suspicious now issue so this is where yes the house is hidden and yes you can just enter like so but this is where a bit of redstone kind of makes sense now to get rid of this boat you have very few options but iscal actually helped me make a small device and it looks super complicated it's not that bad. So this is a <laughs> oh my goodness! Device. <laughs> this is a small device, button. is it? What no redstone, but oh, he uses lava to get rid of it. A piston. It releases lava. Ah, I guess it's simple in, in its design, isn't it? And then it closes itself back up. Yeah, because so you need something, something like, like that. This. You put your boat in here, shift down, and then I've got a button in here, and you can hear it open up. Lava goes out. There we go. So let's take a closer look at that redstone. Rid even just in case you want to copy it, because like me, I need help. So the next hidden house is actually back here where we had the infinity room one. Okay, it's by and the ravine. The hidden house is actually right in front of us here. We need another key, and it is a hoe of any kind, wooden or diamond. It's up to Oh, you. did you do and that? I like that name. Is remember which block it is. You right oh, you till it, the ground, and, it will and then a little minecart. That's clever, right because it will until itself as well. I like that as well. Yeah, because it makes it that one block smaller. Eventually despawn and cover it back up. Oh, no. You're free this to use your base as you anyway. please. Jump around for a little while, realize... There's nothing to do in this base because you finished it, and then you leave. But How'd you get out? There actually is an exit that I've prepared, and it's right here. It's another minecart, just like the bed situation. 
If you get into a minecart oh, when you get shift out. out, ah, clever. It will put you in a specific spot. Meaning you can use that to glitch like through that. the That's diagonal. Cool. I, I think wall. next time I actually make a secret base, I'm going to be yeah. watching right this video again. And I will use one of these. Maybe I'll use all the ways. I'll have like 16 different really, ways into my base. Because really it's really cool. The fastest I love it. For a hidden house. Now, the only bad thing is sometimes this thing can be a little bit annoying and doesn't go away. None of these hidden houses are absolutely perfect, but you will know which one suits you the most. Now, not like every single one. hidden like house needs a really insane glitch or gimmick like the bed thing or the minecart thing or even the boat thing. Some of them can just be really well hidden. And okay, great. One of let's those let's see just a well hidden one then. Is by hiding it underwater, particularly in places like this in a river where you've got lots of vegetation. Oh, I saw it. I saw it. The people I think I saw where it is. It's down here. Pretty to his left, yeah? But if you just hide a one Yeah, yeah, block there it is. I see it down at the bottom middle there. Do you see it, guys? That is pretty well hidden, but not well hidden for all this, but he's got these eagle eyes. Yeah, 2020 vision and all that kind of stuff. You can make yourself but that a is a pretty well hidden little uh, little way still. Oh, and a nice little nether portal really as well. Simple. Doesn't take any like the design. Stone. So not every single hidden base needs to be super complicated. Even things like this work really well. And I've got a couple more just like this one. For example, okay, let's see what else I've got. got here just a normal Minecraft village. And I've got two hidden bases in here as well. The first one, okay... This is the one that uses a little bit of redstone. Whoa, 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 whoa. Read that title. No red... Okay, it says okay, maybe a little. No, we'll let him off. We'll let him it's off. Really he's, 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 we're not being clickbaited, so guys. We're okay. we've got the composter here. And I actually got this idea from B-dubs at, uh, at his, like, hidden base in his Hermitcraft base. And basically, you okay, hop so inside the composter. You hit the, the button. push you down? You need to retract a piston. Ooh. And then you fall straight in. And then you're in your oh. dirt-themed house because I guess pistons push you through composters, house. guys. But let's just take a look at the redstone because it's it's really really simple. So, so I guess yeah, just a piston. Oh, right, yeah, what is going on? Slightly decorated Minecraft generated house. But if we take ah, a look, all it is is sneaky. one piston, one redstone torch, and one redstone dust. Even Wait, I. So it just retracts. To put this together. So when you hit the button. It activates that, retracts it, and just retracts it quick enough that you fall through. Yeah, now, I guess if it was in full block, you wouldn't fall through in time. This redstone is very simple, but it is. But very because it's a composter, you do. So it's just you enough. You have to have a block here, here, and here for this to work. Because if yeah, you otherwise it won't. It can just push you out. I wonder if it works with yeah, a cauldron. Like yeah, that. okay, interesting. It has somewhere to go, but if there's a block in every single direction, and that's why there were leaves here. Then you've, you've got nowhere to go when you're down. So you ah, that makes room. sense. So that's why it has to be a composter. This one, that's probably why. Now, there's actually another hidden house right next door in this very non suspicious crate. Now, I've shown you this. <laughs> oh, crate is it a little trapdoor thing? Many times before. I really love it. It works well, especially as you can put water on top of trapdoors now. Now, all you got to do is you right click it, and then you've got some scaffolding. Nice. That's good. Your base. I like that. I like that. Just a little trapdoor waiting to be so unflicked. No one knows where you are. So, again, another hidden base, no redstone, very, very simple to do. Straight in, straight out. This one, okay, it definitely uses a little bit of redstone. Yeah, yeah it's cheating do you that know one, how mate. hard it is to hide bases <laughs> without just tiny bit of redstone. I know what you mean, Grin. It, it does seem like redstone, no redstone okay, all is a bit right, of a challenge. So You've I done well so far, though. Nine designs, but with the 1.15 update, there was a new one. Okay, it involves a little bit of redstone, but you're really going to love it. So let's hop let's over see. to a it, It's a bit of redstone, but I, if I'm going to love so it, I'm willing to wait. How this works. Okay, so here we are in 1.15. As you can see, what if it's with the honey? Blocks, the honey, the honey curve. What if the honey box is what he uses? This block here that's going to make things interesting. So if I turn the bounding boxes on, you can see hit boxes of stuff. What you can do on this one is actually throw it so that it overlaps. You can see that there. So this got right. me thinking that you could use this for an item detection system where you throw one in and it's hidden by a painting. Ooh. It opens up and you fall down into the But you can't walk through it. Base. That's so good. How because, yeah, you can't walk through work? it. I guess there's a hopper under the honey block. You could normally do this by just hiding a painting and having a dropper behind it. But with the, thing, the thing with paintings is you either remove them by punching them off of a wall or you just try and walk through them. Now, you can't do that with this one because there's honey boxes. Ah, and then they what won't think. They'll just think, oh, it's just honey. Item, 
It's oh, going that's clever. Right in here, just in to that's good. touch. I like that. This that's hopper. clever, Green. I, you know what? Yeah, I like. Okay, yes, there's a bit of redstone, but redstone, as I told it you is very clever, though. So the beds are just over there. And this is a naturally occurring lava pool. Okay. And yeah, I, I think that. I've shown this one before in a previous video. But is this going to jump through it into a water hole? As much as you think. You actually have enough time to pass through it. And to prove this, I'm going to go into survival mode, like so. And what I'm going to do is basically just jump straight in. I'm going to press crouch, and boom. I took basically, two yeah. parts of health. Okay, I took a little <laughs> bit more, but I have got some slime blocks here. And oh. <laughs> That's where I put that thing. What is that? <laughs> yeah, you can put whatever Mumbo you must, uh, I'm not agree with the Mumbo you put in your hidden bases, so you shouldn't judge what I put in my hidden bases. Do you know what I mean? I'll allow Don't it, Green. Judge. I'll allow it. People can steal <laughs> mustaches if they want to. The only issue with this is there's no real good way to get out other than an elytra. What if you put but scaffolding on these like before? You simply look up. Oh no, he's gonna be on fire. Out. Yeah, you're gonna fire though. If you are taking a little bit of fire damage, you just make sure you're near some water. Yeah, I, I mean, I think that is a good one, but it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a painful one, you know. Is, I, I feel like this is one that could go wrong. Potion. Houses are honestly nothing compared to the original hidden house. The original hidden which house, which is simply take your shovel and mine two blocks of dirt. <laughs> And walk in. That's true. That is, <laughs> that is the base. ultimate hidden house. This is this is this just, is the only just just this place it block a couple of blocks in and front you know what? and break them every time you want to leave. Nothing wrong with it at all. So that is number ten. It's probably the simplest. And one. I've got to say, <laughs> no redstone required. Easiest ones to do, and it's probably what I would do if I was just trying to hide my base. If you enjoyed this video of me reacting to it. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. It is a um, is a fairly new one. Try so yeah, you might be subscribed to our main channel, but not this one. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video.